Hey everyone, welcome to Judging for the Win. I'm Dave, and this is my daily ruling. Today's question was suggested by a viewer, thanks to Tarragon Eames for this one. Amy animates Gideon at the Trials. Then, she equips Helma the Host to it and goes to combat. What happens? Okay, first of all, I want to point out that the token created by Helma the Host is not legendary. This means that the legend rule will not apply, because Amy does not control two or more legendary permanents that have the same name. And so that means the token and the original Gideon will both get to stick around. Next, let's recall a fact about copying objects, which is that when you copy an object, you're generally not going to be able to copy any continuous effects that are also acting on the thing that you're copying. I went into a lot more detail about this in my episode where I talked about Krothis plus Serpentine Ambush, and I encourage anyone who's interested in learning more to check that video out for a more detailed explanation. What this means is that when you put the token of Gideon into play, that token is not going to be animated. It's basically just going to look like Amy played another Gideon from her hand. Except that, you know, it's a token and it's not going to be legendary. Now, it is true that none of this token's loyalty abilities have been activated yet this turn, so Amy could animate it if she wanted to. However, because Helm of the Host puts the creature token into play during combat, not during the main phase, that means that Amy would need some sort of way to instant speed activate a Planeswalker loyalty ability, which does exist, but it would be an extra hoop that she would have to jump through if she wanted to be able to attack with it this turn. Finally, there's one more kind of interesting thing that I wanted to point out about this situation. Notice that the emblem that the Gideon gives you only checks to see if you have a Gideon Planeswalker. That means that even though the token is not legendary, it still is a Planeswalker and it still does have the subtype Gideon. So that means it still will save you from losing the game, even if your opponent manages to remove your original Gideon. Pretty cool trick. And that's all I have for you today. How did you do? Join me again tomorrow for another daily ruling, but until then, I hope you have a great day.